100 years ago, members of hundreds of cooperatives up and down our country came together for an emergency meeting here at Central Hall in Westminster. The world was a very different place then. We were in the midst of the greatest conflict the world had then seen. So the decision taken then by those visionary cooperators 100 years ago, not just to lobby, but also crucially to organize, was pivotal. As the chair of that first meeting said, there are things to safeguard, things to stand for, and things to achieve. That statement rings as true as ever today. Thanks to the decision those cooperators took that day, things would change. A former shop assistant would become the first woman in history to serve in the cabinet and join the Privy Council. A blacksmith's son would lead the Royal Navy in Churchill's cabinet. The son of a gas soldier who lost an eye and a leg in the First World War would pass the world's first disability rights legislation. All of them cooperators who believed that if they wanted to change the world, their cooperative values had to extend beyond the shop front. All of them cooperators who traveled the sometimes difficult path into politics in order to defend and champion the cooperative values they held dear. They, and the many others who followed them, fought for the cooperative movement to protect it in tough times and build it in good. The first consumer and environmental legislation. Political and financial support for credit unions and fair trade. And as our economy and society changed, the expansion of cooperation into new areas, including education, football and energy. One victory at a time, cooperators fought for a country where wealth and power were shared. Now we fight again for the same inspiring vision that so many before us gave so much for. Our past gives us strength, our future hope, as we join the fight for a better tomorrow. The symbol of the beehive is as old as our cooperative movement. It reminds us that together we are powerful. It's stitched into our banners, it's etched into the story of our party. People are crying out for a movement that believes in sharing power and wealth. This is our time, and the cooperative party is ready. With more members than ever, and councillors and MPs up and down this great nation. So come with us on this exciting journey ahead, because together we can shape the future. <laughs>